Down here, down here in this pumpkin patch. Yeah, down here where they give up that 17 point lead to them okie dokies. Blew their head up down here in this pumpkin patch known as South Tennessee, baby. What's going on? And it's finally here, baby. We finally get to redeem ourselves from last year with this old piss football team coming into Tuscaloosa, Alabama, baby. And I'm fired up for it. Now you gonna be rolling it being Tuscaloosa, baby. And all I gotta say is, wash your fucking asses. Nobody wants to smell your fucking gonorrhea smelling asses up in our fucking stadium. Alabama fans, make sure you put, bring your damn hand sanitizer for these fucking rebel fans. Don't know how to wash their asses. Don't know how to take care of themselves. Let fucking Katy Perry come down there and change the fucking culture down there at Old Piss. Don't change the cheers. You know, flim, flam, bim, bam, gonorrhea, by damn, that's how it is down there at our fucking old Miss, ain't it? You fucking chumps. Y'all thought y'all got one over on us last year, and maybe y'all did. But understand, if Alabama plays a full football game, we beat your ass, and you fucking know it. So y'all can roll on in and with your high-powered offense and think you're going to beat up on Alabama, but you better understand, we've had this football game circled in three different co colors, Wait for you punk motherfuckers to roll in, and we can't wait for it. Now all I've heard is how good this quarterback is. Don't forget about your mullet man, old Bo Wallace. Hell with him. Hell, he, he, he's the only one that beat Alabama in the last 10 fucking years. Hell with him. Now you got old Chad Kelly in there. His thug ass think he can fucking fight. By God, you're going to be in for a fucking fight come Saturday night, son. And we're going to beat your fucking ass. And there ain't going to be nothing you can do about it, old piss. Yeah. You think you got a tough defense? Hell, you even been putting your defensive lineman running the football. Run the damn football. Let Reggie Ragland light his ass up one time. D won't want to play football then. He'll be up there sitting with his fucking mama. And speaking of the fucking mamas and the papas, what about old Tungle here? Hell, he's got daddy issues. He ain't ready to play no fucking football. He ain't ready for this A train, baby. Y'all fixing to get y'all fucking ass whipped out there down there and y'all gonna take that ass whooping all the way back down to gonorrhea you yeah gonorrhea university baby i still ain't forgot about you damn nasty bitches and them flaherty dresses fucking all them football players getting over all over the media talking their shit crying on the youtube when you got beat by lsu ah, we got beat by LSU. Oh, no. yeah the only thing i can say about that is a corn dog put it straight up in y'all's motherfucking asses last year. And that's what we're gonna do this year, boys. Because you're pretenders, you're not contenders, and Alabama is ready to fucking roll. So with that being said, there's only one thing for me to say from down here, baby. And that's roll tide roll. One time up in this bitch, baby. Woo! Come on, Rebels. Me to send the 50 bitches. Peace, everybody. One love. Country boy can survive. Country folks can survive.